In the wake of the Uvalde school massacre that left 19 students and two teachers dead, a Houston area company is working to make sure that all children are safer in the classroom. Architectural firm PBK says that work starts from the ground up. They gave KPRC2 an inside look at their methods. Our Roseanne Aragon took the tour and wrote the company has been consulting with Uvalde CISD as well. Yes, uh, PBK, we've been covering them for years, and they say they were humbled to have been asked by Uvalde CISD to help and help answer the question, what more can be done? Tragedy beyond words met with humanity and helpers. Uh, we shared with them 32 best practices built by school chiefs of police. Houston-based leading architecture firm PBK answered Uvalde CISD's call for help. We first introduced you to PBK in 2018 when it decided to do something about school violence, <laughs> taking us behind the scenes of their work. And we would love to know bringing together the best experts on school security, ISD police chiefs and law enforcement leaders build the best practices for school safety and security. Uvalde ISD turned to PBK for help just last week. We went through seven schools that day, uh, interviewed some individuals to ask some things about vulnerabilities and then formed our own impression. Providing analysis at no charge. Many of Uvalde's buildings are 40 to 60 years old. Most of them have separate, call it eight classroom and 10 classroom wings. The doors open to the exterior. You're trying to safeguard four buildings, not the perimeter of one building. PBK managing partner Ian Powell says it all comes down to intentional design, leveraging factors like school layout, site, and intruder timing. Reduce the time that law enforcement has to react and to extend the time of the perpetrator before he's able, he or she is able to do damage. Powell says PBK will do everything it can to help Uvalde and build safe communities together. Increasing the toolbox of solutions. Now, PBK says it will provide analysis and reports to Uvalde for as long as it needs, and they will continue to help with whatever they need in terms of school security and design. Reporting live from PBK headquarters, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, 2 News. Roseanne, thank you.